Hello, and welcome to another mini training little tip thing here. Ah, I wonder what I call it, I don't know. I'm Rosemary Noy Knight, and today we're talking about three reasons to be grateful. Now, this is the thing, gratitude is not the norm at all. Uh, most people, yeah, they kind of would say that they're grateful, but really we spend too much time thinking about all the stuff that we don't have, so we don't actually have that much time to think about what we do have. And so gratitude is not the norm, and yet it is very effective in helping us get what it is that we say that we want. However, yeah, you have to be very deliberate about it or else you'll find yourself really not paying attention and not seeing the stuff that you do have. And you might even find yourself questioning, why does it even matter? And that, I suppose, is what this is about. To kind of give you some indications as to why it does matter if you really do want to get the life, the business that you want. So yeah, I recognize gratitude is not the norm, but that does not have to be your story. So number one reason why you want to be um, grateful for stuff and be a lot more conscious or deliberate about being grateful is that you want to move away from lack, don't you? As I already mentioned, lots of people are very focused on what they don't have, but you don't want to be that person. Focusing on what you don't have just gives you more of the stuff that you don't have or more to the point you notice more of the stuff that you don't have instead of seeing what you do have. It's so easy to get trapped in that, oh, I don't have anything, and you, you, don't, you don't even notice that things are so much better for you than they used to be. But you are trapped in that lack and all you see is lack, so how on earth are you going to see opportunities when they come your way? When it, if you're an entrepreneur running a business, how on earth are you going to see opportunities when they come your way if all you can think about is all the things you don't have, all the things you're not doing, all of that stuff? Instead of focusing on the stuff that you do have, the customers you do have, the, the, the prospects that are, that are increasing your circle of influence and all of that stuff, and being grateful for even where you are right now, then you start to see the opportunities for more service so that you can start to create more wealth. So that's one big reason to be grateful. It makes you feel better. Number two, it makes you feel better if you're, you're more grateful. I, I challenge you to write down 10 things that you are grateful for right now and tell me you don't feel better after you've looked at that. If you consciously rack your brain for 10 things that you are grateful for in your current circumstances, even on the bad days, I tell you that you will feel considerably better than you do right now. So it makes you feel better. And when you feel better, you're so much more creative. You're so much more innovative. And so then you are more likely, again, to serve more people. And when you serve more people, guess what happens? You create more wealth. It just happens, okay? So it makes you feel better. It makes you create wealth. <laughs> and then the final reason I wanted to give you today is that it makes other people feel better. If you are an entrepreneur, which I'm sure you are if you're listening to me right now, then the chances are, or if you're not already, you're planning to be, come on now. <laughs> um, the chances are you're going to be dealing with people. It's people you're going to be serving with your product, your service, your music, your books, your art, your whatever it is. It's people you're going to be serving. And if you are a negative so-and-so, always thinking about all the stuff you don't have and complaining about this and that and the other, who do you think wants to be around you? I assure you, nobody. Nobody wants to be around you. So that is it. You start to cut out your business. Yes, they'll smile with you and everybody loves to, you know, smile and be sarcastic with you. But really after that, they don't want to be around you because they feel a little bit more depressed as a result of, yeah, joining in with your sarcasm and lack-based thinking. So come on, let's get very deliberate about being someone who when people come in contact with us, they walk away feeling so much better as a result of the fact that they have come into our presence. Let's take our presence very, very seriously because yeah, we are leaders, okay? This whole entrepreneur thing is not just about us. It's about the people we impact every single day, the lives we change with our product service, blah, 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 blah. All of that stuff of business opportunity, art, music, books, whatever. We change lives with that stuff. So let's be people that lift up the spirits of other people. And then we, they want to be around us more. And when people are around us more, guess what? They buy more of our stuff. <laughs> and when they buy more of our stuff, guess what happens to our bank accounts? Uh-huh. It looks so much better. So yes, so even if it's for completely mercenary reasons, which I really hope it isn't, but if it is, 
being grateful makes you just a better person to hang around, okay? So become a more grateful person, okay? Because there's just so many reasons, and these are just three that I've given you, but there's so many more reasons that will help you increase your wealth. And ultimately, you're an entrepreneur because you want to change lives, you want to change things, and you want to create wealth. So make it easy <laughs> by becoming someone who is deliberately grateful, okay? And if you do want to work out the insides and the outsides, so the tips, tricks, the strategies, and the mindset stuff of creating wealth as an entrepreneur, then you want to grab a hold of the free entrepreneur wealth pack. You can do that by going to rosemarynonnyknight.com forward slash toolkit. rosemarynonnyknight.com forward slash toolkit. Go and get a hold of the free entrepreneur wealth pack now and yeah, start to work on your insights and get the tips, the tricks, the strategies, the techniques to build your business, get more customers, all of that kind of stuff. Okay then, it's been a pleasure speaking to you. Fight for, create the life, the business you want and just stop, 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 stop living the one you don't. Okay then, bye.